and welcome to How To. I am Tanya with Marathon Industries and today we are going to put together the ultimate heavy duty wheelbarrow. So first thing you're going to need is a crescent wrench and a flathead screwdriver to put this together. I've taken everything out of the packaging, spread it all out. It's nice to have it on a flat surface. So you're going to take the longest bolt for the front end of the tray and these are created to, once the bolt is through, kind of hold it in place. I like to slap on a piece of tape. It just helps it secure the bolt while I put the rest of the bolts in. So let's thread that through, settle your tape, and put that on there like that. I've got all four bolts in, washers, Next, we're gonna put the wedges on and the handles. So you'll notice on the end of this, there's one side has the cutout side, that goes face down. Put those on like that, and you'll see the different holes in here. Obviously, it's the top two holes you're gonna use. Slide that on. Okay, next we're going to work on the leg assembly, but I've taken the wheelbarrow off, set it aside, so I've got room to work. So um, pay close attention. You need to make sure these holes are on the outside of the leg. And you're going to take your crossbar. This can be a little bit tricky. You want to slide. That was not tricky at all. See how smooth like butter that was. That goes in like that. So we're going to take out of the package the two smallest bolts and the washers, flat round washer first. The other one on there. Oops. Get the nut on there. Now that I've got the leg assembly all put together, I've brought the wheelbarrow tray back and we're gonna start putting them together. So we've got crossbars here for added strength. Um, for extra heavy loads, you do not want to have this breakdown on you and lose your load. Okay, then we're going to add the leg assembly. Just like that. Then you're going to add your flat washer and the lock washer and your nuts. Okay, we've got our washers. We're going to slide these on the flat washer first and tighten this on there. I'm going to do that for all four. Okay, next we are going to add the nose piece. So that slides on like that. You're going to take two of your longest bolts and thread that through. Okay, next we are going to add the axle bracket and the tray support base and I'm going to Put this all together with one of the long bolts. Put your washers on. It's all about the washers. Next, we are going to attach the Marathon Flat Free wheel. So, thread the axle through the wheel. Really, you do. There it is. Okay. And we are going to drop this down and then thread the axle through the axle bracket. And that will just rest there until we get to the other side. First thing we're going to do is put the axle bracket on this side. So that's steady. We're going to add the front tray brace. Thread that there. And get your washers on. Okay, just secure this last bolt. Next thing I'm going to do before we walk around and tighten all of our bolts is the final attachment here. last thing you need to do, the screwdriver and your wrench, is make sure all your bolts are secure. And then you are ready to use your Marathon Ultimate Wheelbarrow. 
Thank you for watching How To. Have a great day.